Another story of violated trust this morning. When you put your kids on the school bus, you do not expect this to happen. Bullying by a grown-up. The alleged victim here, an especially vulnerable five-year-old. ABC's Ty Hernandez is on the story. Ty, good morning. Hey, good morning, Bianca and Dan. The video is so hard to watch, and it appears to be taken right on the bus, a place where kids are supposed to be cared for. Stop kicking my feet and sit up! It's supposed to be a safe haven, but for one student, this school bus was anything but. What is your problem? Cut it out. No, you have a bus. Cut it out. Newly released surveillance video shows 37-year-old Danetta McPherson, a school bus aide in Port St. Lucie, Florida, repeatedly berating a five-year-old boy who reportedly has disabilities. McPherson, accused of yelling at the boy on several occasions, even threatening to take him home with her and often bringing him to tears. What did I tell you? Huh? What did I tell you? But the bullying came to a sudden stop in December after a school employee reported the alleged abuse to police. You going home with me today? Now. Yes, you are. Right now. After nearly a four-month investigation, McPherson was arrested on Thursday and charged with stalking. According to the police report, there was at least one incident in which McPherson grabbed the boy, causing him to hit his head on the side of the bus. ABC News reached out to her for comment, but got no word back. The boy's family isn't speaking either, but police are. It was an innocent, innocent victim. You know, so it's a violation of public trust as far as I'm concerned. This morning, we know McPherson was released from jail on $20,000 bond. We also spoke to the director of communications for the school board. She says McPherson is still with the St. Lucie schools in a role away from students, though. Her status with the school is pending the legal process. Dan Viana. A lot of parents hope she stays away from children. Ty, thank you. Thanks, Ty.